Hello! In this video, you'll learn how to utilize your students' Hapara folders for Canvas, as well as using Hapara to look over assignments that are in that folder. So to get started, you're going to want to instruct your students to get Google Drive, as you can see here. When they're in their Google Drive, you want them to find the Hapara folder for your class. You'll notice that the Hapara folders don't say Hapara, but they have a little person plus the name of the class with a bunch of numbers at the end. So for this one, I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to be looking for AP World History because I know that's what this student is in currently in a Canvas class. Because this is first semester, I want to look for the one that says S1, as you see here. So the first thing I'm going to have that student do is rename this folder. So we're going to take this folder and right click it or use two fingers and tap on that on a Chromebook. And we're gonna go down and rename. And we'll rename it something like AP World History Semester One. You can put the hour on there if you want to. And you hit okay. The next thing students will have to do is make sure that any file that they're working on in Google gets directed to the appropriate folder. Now Canvas can push out assignments to force students to make a copy, but it can't force those assignments into a folder. So students will have to do that. It's really not that difficult the way that Google has this set up. So for this example, this student has this Buddhism and Hinduism SAQ that they have to turn in. So what you'd want them to do, direct them is as they're working on this, they'll have it open up here and in just a little bit, a little folder will pop up. That happens for any Google Doc. So we're going to have them click on that. And then we're going to have them move it to the folder that they renamed. So in this case, AP World History Semester 1. And then just move it there. Very easy. After the student finishes putting their document into their folder, they should go back to their Canvas course. When they're here, they'll go to Modules. Then they should find the assignment that they have to submit. In this case, it is down here at Hinduism and Buddhism SAQ. They'll click that. When they get to this point, they're gonna wanna submit their assignment. Now this student previously submitted, so it says resubmit. If a student is just starting, it would say submit up there. So I'm gonna click on it. And the really important thing you're gonna to have to direct your students to is to go to Google Drive. So when they click on Google Drive, it'll open up their Google Drive. Now they'll just find the, the folder that they renamed. And when they're in there, they'll find the document that they want to submit. So they'll click on it and then submit it. And there you go, it's all set. Having the folder set up between Canvas and Hapara is very helpful for the teacher for a couple reasons. First of all, the teacher could find the student on Hapara in the dashboard area, and they could see all the documents that are in that folder for that individual student. Also, they could see multiple students and easily go between different students to check in on their work. I hope you enjoyed this video and you find it useful. Have a great day.